I'm Jennifer Wright Summers. Welcome to my home studio. This little worker's cottage was my grandparents' home. Being an older person, I think about the long term when doing my art. For instance, the pavers in the front yard start with the beginning of this little planet in the Milky Way galaxy 4,500 million years ago in unimaginable numbers. And then how the volcanoes formed this land 26 million years ago. And the dinosaurs, like diprotodons, wandered around here. And then the first people arrived about 60,000 years ago. So my, most of my art is about the stories of this place, the long history, the geological time, and my family's history and experience in this place. I believe in creatively using resources, so I use tea bag in my artworks. These tea bags talk about the long periods of time leading up to the Anthropocene. I'm concerned about what's happening with our swamp here. The animals that were in the swamp, like the blue yabby, the white neck crane, the ducks, the Murray turtles, have gone from down here at West Creek. Why have they gone? Because the surfaces have been concreted in. Toowoomba was built here because of the sweet spring water that they needed for the Three X Brewery across the road. In 1900, our first mayor, Groom, decided to drain the swamp. The first people would have looked after the water in the swamp. Swamps were causing waterborne diseases in the settlement. And even recently, when Grand Central was built, that sweet water was pumped away in concrete drains. The thing is, the water isn't getting down into the soils. My family's only been here for seven generations. The first people were here for 1,500 generations. They cared for this soil. The precious land was their mother. When we deforest an area, when developers clear fell an area, that releases carbon and increases the carbon in our atmosphere that contributes to climate change. So I, my vision for Toowoomba is a move to intergenerational responsibility, where we're responsible for looking after the natural resources that are gifted to us. Please stop clearing vegetation, save the soils, save Mount Lofty.